Hey there beautiful people out there, it's me again. So today I'm going to do a part two of my mixed kids hair care series that I started. In the first video you guys saw what products I used on Maddie's hair and also how to you know do basic styles on her hair. You know I hope was beneficial for you moms out there with mixed kid type hair or natural hair for young babies as well. I want to show you today how we wash her hair and condition it and what we do to set it at night because after you know she takes a bath you know her hair is wet and then she goes to bed so we don't like that because we want to make sure that she's not going to bed with a wet head which you can get a cold from. We're going to show you her wash day regimen and hopefully that will inspire you or that will show you a way of how to take care of your mixed kid or natural natural hair kids hair in the shower or when you do their when you wash their hair on this wash day all right so out any further ado let's get 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 it all right so I'm going to use the shampoo and detangling conditioner on her hair today so I only put a small amount because the lather is amazing on these products or at least the shampoo it is and that's enough to get all around her hair. So I'm just going to spread the soap all around her hair to make sure everything gets cleaned and washed. Now I'm going to take my shampoo brush, which I got from the beauty supply store, and I'm just going to comb through her hair to make sure her hair is not tangled and you know make sure that the soap goes through her hair, scalp, and everything else. And then I'm going to rinse her hair using warm kind of cold water so that way her hair can soak in some moisture. And then I'm using the shampoo comb to comb through that as well. Then I'm going to take a little bit of the deep conditioner. Oh, I meant to tell y'all I recorded this before but I had to do it again because my camera kept cutting off. So I'm only going to put a little bit just for video purposes. But I usually put at least a quarter size in her hair. And then I use the shampoo brush to detangle through and you know just to make sure that her hair is not tangled and you're supposed to leave it on for three to five minutes so I did just that and then I want to rinse it off using warm water and make her cover her eyes so it doesn't get in her eyes and then after I'm done I'm just going to comb through her hair using a shampoo brush just to comb out the tangles and as you can see how moisturized and just how untangled her hair is because her hair can get tangled y'all the struggle is real but with this stuff it really helps to keep her hair detangled and look at that hang time okay we got hang time all right so now i'm going to use this good old detangling spray just to help with you know keep her hair detangled and it smells so good oh my gosh and now i'm going to use my denman brush to comb out any tangles even though there aren't any in her hair right now but just to make sure that her hair is thoroughly combed through before i go to the next part so as I stated um, before she goes to bed I like to make sure that her hair is not wet so I take my hair dryer and I blow dry her hair on cool setting because cool setting helps to seal in some moisture and it actually helps to dry a little bit quicker just a little bit quicker and I just don't want her to have heat damage because heat damage is the devil okay and then after that I'm going to take my dimming brush and just comb through to make sure all her tangles are out and voila look at all that hair shake it shake it shake it shake it uh -uh. shake it hey, hey. shake it girl so she is feeling her hair yes ma'am so we love this hairline we highly recommend it it's very affordable and it works so i highly recommend you guys try it out and see if it works for your kids hair so thank you guys so much for watching and as usual don't forget to like comment and subscribe and we'll talk to you all in another video bye peace